Yay. We're going to do it again. It's that time of day that I look forward to every day. How are you? We got so many people in the house already. New Zealand's here. Belgium, you're here again. Good. We got uh, Washington. We got New York. We got Florida. Florida's here in the house. Wherever you are right now, just know you are connected. We are all connected. We are doing this. How are you holding up? You know, coming to the end of this first week. How's it going for you? I know it gets a little weird for me. It gets uh, a little strange. It forces us to stay in the now, like right here, right now. We'll think about tomorrow, tomorrow. But right here is right now. And I'm so glad you're all here. I'm so, so glad we're doing this again. Um, I get all excited. I start thinking about what songs I'm going to do for you. And today, oh, thank you for all of your requests. I have so many songs. And I love that you all like different songs. It's, it's really exciting because I've got about 60 songs now that i got to do for you. So I'm going to be here every day doing bits, of, <laughs> bits and bits. And we're working on that set list, getting it done. But uh, today, decided to do a little bit of a theme. It's uh, songs that were in movies of mine. Not all of them, not the Oscar winner, I'm not doing that one today, but uh, doing some others. And uh, I got a lot of requests for this song. So uh, this was, let's see, it was 1995, I think, right around there. And I got a request and I got a script sent to me from this movie called Boys on the Side. And I love, love writing music for, for movies. It really makes me happy. Uh, it's, I get to kind of get out of my own mind and put myself into another character and another, uh, you know, another life and really put that on and, and then put myself into it. And a lot of these songs have, um, have lived on and, and I've put on albums and this one was on the Boys on the Side soundtrack for those of you who, some of you discovered me on that uh, soundtrack. It's a really awesome soundtrack if you haven't, just just a lot of female artists, really, really exciting soundtrack if you don't have it, check it out. And uh, this song was played at the very end of the movie, right as the car drives away. <laughs> I always dreamed I'd be the, the ending song to a movie. I think it's a powerful, powerful place to be. You know the song, it's called I Take You With Me. Past the devil's own temptation Beyond where angels sleep To the holy invocation Of a neon city street
will never, ever understand it How the journey led me here How you doing? How we doing? I know that doing this gave me an excuse to cut my nails today. <clears throat> I think personal care is very important. We need to, uh, if you haven't washed your hair since Monday, it's time to wash your hair, okay? <laughs> yes, go do that. Change into real clothes, take a walk. Take a walk, come back. Doesn't mean we can't be in nature. That's not what this is about. It's about, you know, six feet from somebody sort of thing. It's about staying inside for the, the health of others. And that's the best thing we can do. We're going to flatten this curve. We're going to get through this. We're, yes, we are. <laughs> so, so there's lots of things we can do. We can make up um, little, little uh, goals for us. I have a goal. I want it to be uh, completed in the next couple of days. It's actually something I've wanted to do for a long time. I'm going to take all my uh, sweatpants and like uh, sweaters and things that have the drawstrings, you know, the drawstrings that have gone up one side and now that's just one long string on the other side. I'm going to find that safety pin and I'm going to pull them all the way through. Come on. We've got time to do it. It's time. Do it. It's, I, I'm challenging you. The drawstring challenge. All right. Show me. You're pulling here. <laughs> Come on. It's, it's a goal. I'm going to do it. I'm actually wearing a pair. It made me think because I'm wearing a pair of pants where the drawstring is just one all the way down to my knee, you know. Mm. I love everyone who's been um, connecting with me on Twitter. It's uh, M at, at M Etheridge is how you can find me. That's how you can request the songs. Thank you for telling me, you know, the stories. I love that uh, we got families watching now, kids, hello, and stuff. And it's just, it's it's been, it's been really great for my soul. So thank you so much. I hope this is bringing you some joy. So, yeah, so Boys on the Side was one movie, and of course, this was an idea that uh, Shannon, you had, so thank you. I stole this idea. I said, yeah, we should do a movie, movie day. So, um, another movie that I wrote a couple of songs for, I was called in, it was 1989, I just put my second album out. No, I just put my third, it was 1990, and I just put my third album out. And um, I was called in as a songwriter to watch this film with Win Winona Ryder. And it was uh, called Welcome Home, Roxy Carmichael. And this is when Winona was just starting to take off. She was still kind of young and, and um, crazy looking. And, uh, and so they showed me this film and I thought it was a really sweet, sweet, sweet film. A uh, story about a girl who thinks that she was adopted and the daughter of this famous person. The, the, and the woman that was famous, Roxy Carmichael, was famous because she ran off to LA and met a songwriter and the guy wrote a song about her. So that's really uh, the only reason she's famous. The song was supposed to be called In Roxy's Eyes. But I wrote this song and uh, they put it in the movie and they were gonna have the guy sing it in the movie, but they enjoyed my version of it so much that in the movie when you're watching it, uh, she's in a bookstore or something and it comes on the radio, uh, the announcer says, and here's Melissa Etheridge's version of Jack so-and-so's version of that. So it's like in the movie there was a cover version of Jack's song, which I thought was real funny. But uh, I was very grateful that they put um, this song in. And I ended up putting it on my Yes I Am album, the album I assume most of you got. And the song is called I Will Never Be the Same. 
So you walked with me for a while Bed your naked soul You told me of your plan How you would never let them know In the morning of the night You cried long lost child and I tried oh, I tried to hold you when you were young when you were wild but I I will never be the same of your life I never wanted for myself but you guarded them like a lie placed up on the highest shelf in the morning of the night when I woke to find you gone Also got a um, lots of requests for another song that was in that movie. This song is not available on any records or anything because after they made the movie, well, they made after they completed it, they were just about done, and they um, they asked, they said, we'd like an opening song, and that was such a you know, as much as I love an ending song credit, I love an opening song, and so they said we just need like two minutes, so I just wrote this little little. Diddy for the beginning of the movie Then I never thought to put it on anything. I kind of just forgot about it and uh, some of you super duper duper fans um, have uh, Have requested that first song and and now that I you know, I, I brushed up on it make sure I still knew how to sing it. It's been 30 years uh, I uh, I realized it, it's really um, 
it's really a, a it, it, it's a good song. It's a good song. It has um, it has a real meaning in it because in the movie, uh, Winona Ryder is very different, and you know how when we feel like we're different, it, it can uh, it can make us you know think that everybody's staring at us and stuff like that. So this song is called um, "Don't Look at Me." All right, so also from Welcome Home, Roxy Carmichael. circles into squares You can spend precious time marching in your perfect line But I don't hear that drum I'm looking for something else And if you don't like what you see, you don't have to look at me If you don't like what I say You can turn the other way. If you don't song short song you can go see if you can find welcome home roxy carmichael watch it tonight that'll that'll be your homework <laughs> it's uh it's a good it's a fun little movie it's a fun movie to take in you know it's got uh all those jeff daniels all those 90s stars in it it's really it's a fun movie so how you doing you breathing you holding it all right i was thinking I was thinking about you know there's there's a lot of a lot of you out there who are alone who are who are living alone and there's a there's a lot to um, you know to say to you about connecting and taking care of yourself and and making sure you're drinking you know enough water I'm going to tell you that every day make sure you drink enough water water is going to keep you healthy and keep you sane but then I started thinking about those of us who are partnered who have our uh, our wives and our husbands and our girlfriends and boyfriends and people that we're living with. And this can be just as, as stressful on that too, because you know, usually when we're living our normal lives, we have, uh, we have jobs, we have things that take us away from each other and it's always fun to come back together. But um, when you start having day after day after day after day together, that can sometimes be hard and there might be some of us who are having difficult relationships and if we are forced to be together in that uh, situation, that can be difficult. So I urge you, those of you who are coupled in a relationship, to take care of yourself, to maybe step back when, when um, it seems like someone is just irritating the hell out of you, you know what I mean? You know, if someone's if someone is uh, not seeming to understand what you're saying, you know, th there's nothing wrong with stopping and going, you know what, time out. I just need a time out. Go step outside, go do whatever, because everyone's just doing the best they can. You know, we really are. That's all you gotta do is just do the best you can every day. Forgiveness is huge. Gratitude, gratitude, well, gratitude solves all kinds of problems. You know, the minute you start feeling that way about your partner, put some gratitude. Go, man, I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful uh, for the years we've had together. I'm so grateful for the house that we're in. I'm so grateful for the food we get to eat. I mean, start simple and then build up your gratitude because gratitude's great medicine. 
and it'll really help you. Not that I'm having any problems. <laughs> you know, we're all we're all human, and we all have uh, we all have our own perception of what's going on. We all have our fears. Don't let that fear get a hold of you. So, uh, last song I'm going to do for you for movie day or movie night, wherever you are in LA, it's still day on the East Coast at nighttime. In Europe, it's late nighttime. I appreciate you setting your alarms and getting up and and seeing me. This is a big part of my day. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate everybody. Speaking of relationships, look, my wife just put her head in and said, through a, I was just talking about relationships, my love. What? And I was just talking about how we all, that sometimes being, um, you know, quarantined in a house, you know, with your partner hour after hour, that it can be challenging. That's all I'm saying. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> love you. Love, I love everybody. Love you, sweetheart. I'm going to take myself for a walk. Oh, okay. See, she's going to go take a walk. <laughs> Taking care of herself. That's how it is. Linda made a, an entrance. Okay, so uh, another song. There's there's other songs that have been in movies. I just uh, wanted to do these for you today. But this song, I don't even know what that was. This song, um, oh, one of my favorite mov movie projects I ever did was a Brother Bear 2. That's a movie you can watch tonight. Find Brother Bear 2, not one. One is Phil Collins. Doesn't really sound like me. Two, they approached me. And the funny thing, they approached me right like a couple of months, not even, like a month maybe, before I uh, was diagnosed with cancer. So I took this project on, and then I was diagnosed with cancer. So bless the wonderful people at Disney who, who put this movie together. They're really some uh, just sweet, sweet people. They ended up coming out to my house, and there I was. I, it, it gave me something to do when I was on chemo, and I could do it. I, I write, would write these songs and um, they came out when I was all uh, all uh, chemoed out, you know, all bald and everything and um, they uh, they listened and poor this song about broke their hearts so uh, I really, uh, this is a special song for me, I love that those of you who have uh, watched the movie and are fans, you really um, uh, you know Taking this song to heart. I recently did this song with some symphony shows last year that was really, really, really fun. So I'm gonna uh, leave you with this. And, um, you know, I'm sending this out to all of you. Just so much love. We're, we're headed to great change. We really are. When you wonder why we're going through this, it's because our whole society is, is ready for a change. We're ready for, for more peace. We're ready for more. Uh, interconnectedness with our diversity, to not be afraid of diversity. And you know that, we all know that. You're good, wonderful people. You're lovely. Um, I'm gonna see you tomorrow, right here, same time, okay? Here's a song called, wait a minute, I was gonna talk about guitars, hold on. Some of you noticed I've played a different guitar every single day. That's fun. Um, I decided to pull out 12 string today. So uh, who knows what I'll have tomorrow. It will be me. If you hear a voice in the middle of the night saying it'll be all right be me. If you feel a hand guiding you along, when the path feels wrong, it will be me. There is no mountain that I can't climb, for you I'd swim through the rivers of time. As you go your way and I go mine, a light will shine and it will be me. If 
there is a key that goes to your heart a special part it will be me if you need a friend call out to the wind to hold you again it will be me oh how the world seems so unfair creating a love that cannot be shared as you go your way and I go mine a light will shine and it will be me The sun and the moon, the land and the sea, look all around you, it will be me. There is no mountain that I can't climb, for you I swim through the rivers of time. Thank you so much. That was a little movie theme. I hope you all are just taking care of yourself. I love you. I love you. Be strong. Speak true to each other and especially to yourself right here. Spread the peace. Choose only love. It's a choice every day. We have enough fear. We don't need any more fear. Choose love. All right, you guys. See you around. Bye-bye.